up Aaron's Rock 50 here and today uh, this is gonna be kind of the start of a special mini series I'm gonna be doing what I'm gonna do for like the next quite a few games I'm going to just be playing with a single tower type so today I'm going to start out with, with soloing with only tax shooters <laughs> so I mean if you're wondering like why aren't you just starting with dart monkeys they're the first tower well I actually already did a v video with me going only dart monkeys that was actually a really cool video. Um, if you haven't seen it, it, the link is in the description. Uh, you probably want to check it out. It's actually pretty sweet. So yeah, tax years only, except a village for camos, because you know, it got to be fair. I got to make sure I can pop at least all balloon types. So I probably am going to use villages you know, to help out a couple towers that are quite disabled. And the other two are just going to load in. So who's this? Evil Day. Well, he's got a pretty good uh, win-loss record. See how well he does against attack shooters. Um, generally, I'm going to you know use the tower like the best I can. Like if it has a way to pop camels or lights, I'm gonna go for it. I'm not gonna take the wimpy way out and choose a village, but if I have to use a village for camel detection like here, then I probably will, because there is no possible way that attack shooter can pop uh, camos. So I absolutely need a village for that. So, um, yeah, he started off with Boomeranger, and, um, honestly, attack shooters are not that hard of a tower to solo with. They can handle lots of balloons, and they can handle rushes. The only thing they'll have uh, difficulties with are Moabs. So I'm probably going to either get a ton of, um, um, what's this called? Tax sprayers? Yeah, get a ton of tax sprayers to take down the Moabs, or just beat my opponents before round, uh, 18. I don't know, I'm just kind of chilled in here. What's the temperature? I don't know. I'm just cold in here. Um, for some reason. I don't know why. I'm wearing a short sleeve shirt and all. I mean, that might be part of the reason, but I'm usually not this cold. I don't know. Whatever. So I'm, I'm starting off with a single um, tax spare. I'm probably going to get a second. Then I'm going to go for a bunch of blade shears, because those are really good at thinning out crowds. Let's see. Is he going to start sending out blues now? He knows how to econ me. He's got a Glaive Rock Shade, though, which is probably better than a Bionic Boomer on this map. Because on this map, Bionic Boomer's not very good at all, to be honest. Ah, heck. I'm just going to probably go over to um, Blade Shooter here, I think. I don't know. I mean, my textures that I have right now are actually doing fine against blues, so I'm going to keep sending out Economy. Yeah, screw that. Um, just going to keep sending out Economy Balloons. And none of them are getting past, because, you know, right here is a good spot for attack shooters. They get two shots to the balloons. Which is probably where I want to attack shooter. If he continues to use this uh, single uh, Glaive, glaive Rick shit, then I'm going to send out blacks at him. Because, um, there's no reason he should be lasting that long with a single tower. So I'm going to exploit it. I am going to exploit it. Let's see. Round 5, more economy. I'm probably going to want to prepare for green cell, so this is when I'm going to want my blade shooter. As soon... As the next economy boost comes. Perfect. Now I wait for him. Let's see, what's he gonna do? I'm gonna save up a bit of money. Then I'm gonna send out a black rush. Because I don't see him getting much more. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm actually shivering now. It's gotten quite cold in here. I don't know what's up with that. I mean, of course it's cold outside. But, I'm generally not that cold inside. I don't know what's up. So yeah, leak. Leak my pretty. Leak all the balloons. Oh wow, he's actually leaked a ton of lives. Shoot, maybe I should go back to blacks. Um, yeah, that cost them to leak so much. Um, and since I have a bit of excess money, I'm going to go for another attack prayer. Got to remember though that um, I do need um, a ring of fire for round 10. When lights come, oh, but I won't need it. Gotcha. He probably should have got that up to buy a boomer instead of uh, spending more money on economy loot. It really wasn't worth it for him. Alright, sweet. One win down. Attack shears are doing great so far. Let's keep this up. <coughs> so it's about the end of spring break for me. Last day for me. Back to Going back to school tomorrow is going to suck. Like, it, it's just going to suck a lot. Because I've been so used to staying up kind of late and not, you know, going to sleep. And I'm going to feel like crap waking up tomorrow. That is about it. 
So same map, just a different side. And a different opponent. His record is not that good. So it'll be interesting to see, to see what he does. I would assume, though, most newer players focus on defense. So I think he should be able to hold off any attack I throw at him. But you never know. I want to just see what other two towers I get. Ah, perfect. Boomer and Buccaneer. Excellent. Not like he'll be using them, but it's just interesting to see what random towers I get. I want. I like just laying it sit out. So he's gonna start one of the apprentice. Interesting. Yeah, Chris did uh, some research on this and why apprentices are bad. Um, so yeah, I'm literally gonna play through every tower, including stuff like Super Monkey, Buccaneer, that kind of stuff. I am going to try every single tower, not just the overused ones like uh, Chris did in his mini series. I'm going through every single tower. I don't know. Some are going to be interesting. Like, um, using maybe all glue gunners or ice towers. Because obviously those can't damage Moabs. I got to be, uh, very cautious about that. So, yeah. Some of these are going to be quite interesting. Tax year actually should not be too hard. I, I love using tax years. They're a great tower. Um, maybe not too much Moab damage. But besides that, I think I should be good. So he's got two princes, both at 1-1. One, one. I guess they're barely holding off those reds, but really it does not... <clears throat> I don't know, they're barely holding off the reds. Now they're kind of starting shooting rhythm now. It's pretty cool when you get to, like, time your tower, so it's... So, like, it's not like they're both shooting at the same time, but it's like one shoots and then the other shoots. If you can get that to time, if you can get that timing to work out really well, um, you can get some pretty cool synchronization going in. Pretty powerful stuff. So he's sending out pinks. I think all I'm going to need is a second 0-0 zero zero attack share to handle these pinks. I think I should be fine on besides that. Oop, there goes three lives. That's about it. Surprisingly, you're not going to get um, pink balloons past uh, pink attack shooters. Because attack shooters love pink. That's why they are pink. So yeah, he's trying to send out blue balloons now. Even those won't even r overrun my uh, attack shooter combo like you saw last video. So now he's getting a banana farm. I believe he has a 2-1 wizard and a 1-1. One one. And zero zero banana farm. So he's going mainly banana farm economy. I don't see him sending many balloons out at me at all. Although I'm still going to get this up to um, 2-2. Two because two. then we'll see uh, what he sends. If he sends blacks, actually probably either way, I'm just going to get this up to blade shooter. Without a doubt, blade shooters are a lot better against lots and lots of balloons. So I already have a tax sp sprayer to take down the strongest balloons. What was this? What, what, what? <laughs> Current cash, 860. Blade shooter, er, no. 680. Blade shooter, 680. The frick? That's just messed up. <laughs> Alright, whatever. I got my blade shooter now, so it's all good, but. Whoa, what was that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, time to send out greens. Let's see if he sends anything. I bet he'd be tempted to send blacks or something. If he does and they do significant damage against me, then I'll probably get a third tax shooter. Or probably up the sprayer this time. At least that is a plan. I don't see myself overrunning him because um surprisingly lightning wizards are good against fast you know, few fast balloons like pinks and blacks and that kind of stuff. But they just have issues against lots and lots of balloons. So I'm just gonna keep going economy. He has two one zero farms now, which isn't that much economy if you think about it. The way I think about it is um I think I did the math a while ago. It's like if you have one two zero farm, that's the equivalent to having maybe an extra one hundred fifty economy. That's it. That's not much. So in reality, he has maybe about four hundred economy every six seconds, which is pretty bad. Pretty bad indeed. All right. Now what I like to do with the round, end of round seven, I'm just gonna kind of wait out. I'm gonna send some yellows. See how well he does against these. If he owns them. If he has, if he really struggles against them, they'll save up and make him regens. But he, it seems he's doing fine against them. Plus, I probably need to save up for my own ring of fire. That'd probably be handy. A four-two ring of fire. I mean, I want to be able to pop luds in some way, so gotta start saving up. And uh, round ten isn't too far away. Maybe I'll get him with grow pinks if he uh, sticks with the towers that he has. Uh, I, yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Perfect. 4-2 uh, Ring of Fire. This thing has a lot of popping cars. like 60 or something in that range. It's pretty good, actually. 
Um, let's see. So, yeah, save up a lot of money for regrow pinks. I don't see him being able to stop those. Lots and... Oh, my! <laughs> he got a um, blowback wizard. Which may help him in the short run, but... If I can get him to make a regen farm or something. I don't know. I did get a good amount of lives on him. Unless if... Uh, yep, it just showed up wrong on my screen. Dang it, I only got eight lives on him. <laughs> Holy crap, two tornado wizards. What's up with that? Well, frick, now I actually really need uh, camo detection. That seems like a necessity. <laughs> ah, dang it, I was hoping I could beat him before uh, camo detection was necessary. I do have a good amount of economy, but I definitely over economy him. <laughs> Almost a thousand. So yeah, he's got two tornado wizards. wonder how well those would do against a rainbow rush. I don't know, but he sent out some camo blacks, which are not going to do anything, or not going to do much to me now, now that I got my camo detection up. A few lives, that's about it though, nothing major. And I'm going to prepare to get this uh, Blade Maelstrom, because I have a feeling he's going to sell his farms for Rainbow Rush. If he does, I'll be prepared. I'm watching you, I'm watching your farms right there. Perfect. I just want to make sure I always have enough money for a Blade Maelstrom. How much is it, 2430? Alright. So I'll send some balloons, but shoot, I don't want to drop below 2430. Though if it gets to a point where it's almost ceramics time, then I'm probably just going to get a lot more uh, tax sprayers. Yeah, I'm going to get a ton more tax sprayers now. Maybe one, can I fit one right? Ooh, I can fit one. Come on. Fit, where'd it go? Come on. That one little, ah, uh, come on. Uh, it's so tough positioning these. It's like, there we go. Perfect. You want them close to the track so as many of the attacks uh, can hit the ceramics as possible. What What are you doing? Okay. Oh, you meant to s send a regrow ceramics. Activate ability again. Ah, oh, man. I, I actually might. Oh, that was a whole re ceramic right there. Holy bejeebus. That was crazy. <laughs> Yeah, unfortunately, attack shooters are not too great against ceramics, but I was I was expecting a tad more. Maybe I just need more uh, attack sprayers. That's all. More attack sprayers. But yeah, I, I saw those regal leads at first. I'm like, whoa. He he probably meant to send ceramics. Yeah, I, I had a lot of uh, excess money though saved up. If I had just been smarter with my tower placement and stuff, or building towers, if I've been able to build towers faster, would it been good? But it took me so long to place that one tower on the edge. It probably wasn't even worth it. And who we have here? Zigzifrafrazia did Zig Six. That is him. And it's also on Yin Yang. So, unfortunately, we get to see three games on Yin Yang. I'm just picking those two. Get it over with. Darn. Whatever. I did want to explore some other maps with the textures. But Yin Yang will do since they're at least decent on Yin Yang. But they're not good against ceramics. I have I always have issues against ceramics on Yin Yang. Probably should get more attack sprayers. Darn. Well, let's see if I can um do a bit better against this guy. Looks like he's starting out with a zero zero attack shooter. Er, yes, that is attack shooter, my friends. Can't you see their similarities? This, my bad. A zero two boomerang, which he'll probably get up to zero three. Which I don't know. I don't see it doing too good against all these reds and stuff. Or maybe it's 1 3. No. No, it's uh, 0 2. Oh, no, no. That was 1 2. Now it's 1 3. So I guess he'll be fine against those uh, reds and stuff. Yeah, sorry. Just got tag shooters on the mind. I gotta get him. Shoot. <laughs> I'm feeling really crappy today. Kind of valid. Maybe allergy, maybe cold, I don't know. It's kind of something weird in my throat right now. Dawns feel too good. Eh, just an extra zero zero attack shooter. Now I gotta wait for this balloon to go all the way around. Then round four starts. Then I can start sending off blues. Perfect. So, of course, he's sending out pinks, but those are not gonna be an issue because I have two attack shooters. Except for lag. That one just lagged right past. Oh, I still got it anyways. Nice. I think this yellow's going to get by, though. Well, in the form of a blue, but you get the idea. Maybe this yellow. It's actually lagging quite a bit. Holy. Wow. I'm going to want to uh, refresh my browser after this game. <laughs> this would be my third game of textures, though, so it's the last one of the 
saga. Am I able to click on this by chance? I don't, I don't know why everything is so slow right now on my computer. It's not making much noise. Usually I can tell when my computer is having issues what it like makes a ton of noise. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. My computer is bad either way. So he's got two boomerangs now. I think he should be fine against blacks. Especially since he spent so much money on that 2-3 and 3-0 stuff. Yeah, he didn't need all that. I just spend more money on blues. I'm going to get this up 2-3 now. Help myself out. And yeah, who do you think spent more money on towers here? Me or him? Probably him. But yet we still have a similar um, defense for round 6. Or I mean... Uh, we both have effective defenses for round six. We should be able to hold off anything that the opponent throws at us. Yeah, think about that, guys. Cost effectiveness. Cost effectiveness. <laughs> All right. Round six. He's still sending pinks. What's up with that? I bet he had like a ton of them queued or something. And he, he wants to send blacks, but it's just taking forever for these pinks to run out. Whatever. I need more economy. Just slightly more. Then I'm going to want to go back to more attack shooters. Because two, I don't know how well two of them will do. What's he doing? He's getting his mortar already. My god. I love how delayed everything is though. Um, like on. I'm going to click this. Oh, never mind. That wasn't delayed. But everything else seemed delayed to me. Maybe a tad more economy. Oop. Yellow time. Yellow. Yellow, yellow, yellow. I'm going to get up to maybe 800 economy, then I can stop. Stop in peace. Oh shoot, I'm actually going to want to get this up to a ring of fire. The ring of fire. What, what are you doing? Sending out... He, he sent out... He's sending out every balloon type at me. I saw some greed, some pink, some black, some white, some yellows. It's the rainbow. How much is a ring of fire? 2,500? So I just don't want to dip below 2,500. Because then I'll have the ring of fire. Perfect, okay. I'm gonna get this up to 4-2 so this can extend a bit extra range. This extra range is good. And so I can uh, use his full maximum popping potential. You know, mortars actually really aren't good on Yin Yang. So many pinks are gonna get um, by them when it's uh, aimed in that spot. So if you're on Yin Yang, go with the village. Instead of mortar, it's so much better. Plus the uh, price reduction is really helpful. You know, now that I think about it, Monkey Fort, um, increasing the popping power of all nearby towers by one should actually be really helpful for these tax shooters, especially tax sprayers. I mean, you know, now they'll have like, you know, now all the tax sprayers will have double their popping power and blade shooters will have even more popping power. It'll be pretty sweet, actually. So now I'm just saving up money. I'm waiting to see what he'll send. If he sends camels, I'll upgrade this. If he sends a rainbow rush, I'll upgrade this. But something tells me. Probably gonna need a second one. Just because. Because lag. We all know how laggy my computer is. Very. Alright, so I got my uh, finger on this now. I'm watching. I'm watching. I can actually smoke him with the Rainbow Rush really easily. You know what? I'm probably just gonna do that. Well, do Rainbow Rushes ever work for me? No. Lol. I'm gonna try it anyways. It's, and that's not that big of a rainbow rush, but in Yin Yang, kind of. Oh my god. I, I, I just finished saying, when do rainbow rushes ever work for me? Hmm. Th they don't. They never work for me. Even if I sent out bigger, it still wouldn't have made a difference. It, it just really wouldn't have. Now I'm just gonna freaking spam tax sprayers. Because those are gonna be useful against ceramics. But see, 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 I ain't crazy. I ain't crazy. Although, I kind of do want one of these so I can activate the ability. Come on. Why does it take so long? Everything's so delayed. I'm actually surprised I'm surviving with all this lag. All the lag. Ah, lag city. <laughs> there we go. Tag spray or power. All right. I love how he didn't even notice I don't oh he noticed shoot he noticed oh god oh god what the frick 
I was so close to killing him. That's depressing. That, that, that's annoying. That's annoying. All right, can we go for one more game? Let's make this far. I gotta end this well. I, I just wanted to say, I love how he didn't notice I have no camo detection. Then he sends a camo balloon. Of course, of course. The frick. Ah, oh, what the frick. I probably only should have sent, like, three ceramic balloons or something. But I gotta end this with a win. Can't just end with another loss like this. Oh, look, in Yang again. We have seen this map too much. Too much, I say. I don't know what's up with that. All four games have been on Yin Yang. Which is crazy. It's crazy. And confirm. Alright. Confirmed the same time as me. <laughs> At least we know um, masses am massive amounts of uh, tax sprayers are good against ceramics. <laughs> Even though it's quite inefficient. It's, it's pretty funny, actually. Well, that is an interesting boomerang spot. I've not seen that spot yet. I can't see it being effective. <laughs> yeah, I really do not see that spot being effective, like, at all. Could probably get him with, like, pinks or something, but I don't want to waste my money on that. Oh, yeah, but speaking of... Sp thinking about that last video, I'm never... How, how many times have I said I'm never sending a rainbow rush again? But they, then I give it another chance, and it still doesn't work for me. It lets me down. Rainbow rushes work only against, well, like, only against me, apparently. Although, they don't really work against me anymore. It seems that they just, like, but become less powerful recently. I mean, think about it. He only had one Glaive Rickshay. And he was able to stop that pretty easily. Maybe it was because the Glaive Rickshay gets two chances at all those balloons. I still don't think it would have made much of a difference, even if the rush was bigger. Alright, though, the round, um, should be over. Perfect, time to start sending up balloons now. <laughs> this should be an interesting battle, though, um, with my computer being, uh, very laggy and all that. I don't know. Maybe if I get lucky, tax sprayers can pull me to victory and all that. Good stuff. I just hope he doesn't make this last until my apps, because I would suck. Because tax years aren't going to do too good against my apps. Sorry to say it, but it's the truth. Holy crap, these guys are missing so much because of the lag. Generally, they should be popping every balloon that comes, but hits just aren't re registering. So what I'm going to do is um, get this up to 2-0. A bit extra popping power. Um, and yeah, so this boomer's up to 2-3, and it's like sh shooting all over the place. It's going crazy. Yeah, oh boy, my, computer, my computer's also going crazy. Should not be as leaking leaking as many lives as them right now. But the reaction time of everything is so slow. But why? But why? Oh, this is gonna cost cost me quite a few lives. Oh, um blade shooter time, almost. Alright, blade shooter time. If this doesn't help hold off all the blue balloons, I won't know what to say. Honestly, my computer is just too bad. It's, it, it's just bad. I don't, I don't know why it's actually so slow. Maybe it's because I'm running a scan or something. Probably need to end that scan. Seems like it'd help. Yeah, it seems I'm leaking a lot more than I should be. A lot. And I mean, oh wait, why am I not sending blacks versus this guy? Hello. He doesn't stand a chance versus blacks. Why, why am I not sending them? Because I'm stupid, that's why. What am I going to do? I'm going to get another blade shooter. Maybe. If necessary. Seems he's kind of busy um, getting up his own uh, defense. Well, I'll keep sending him more blacks. I got him down to quite a few lives. Got to end with a win here, guys. Got to end with the W. Even if it's by blacks or regrow whites. Because that's the next thing I'm sending. Regrow whites. Not regrow yellows, even though I probably should. Maybe I will make them regrow yellows. I gotta make this a blade shooter. Yeah, I, he's screwed. He's finished. Gotcha. Ah, there we go. Ending with a W. And with this uber likey computer, I'm glad it was on round date. So thanks all you guys for watching. That was uh, the tax shooter video. Doing all that crazy stuff with tax shooters. Now you get to see their weaknesses and stuff. But definitely don't solo with them. They're... 
you know, great and all, but you really do not want to solo them. It's definitely not easy. So that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Um, yeah, be sure to like the video if you did. I do like likes and all that. Huh. Alright, um, that's about it, guys. Bye.